Hi, this is Frankie the Bull with another episode of From the Case to the Plate from Great American International Seafood Market in beautiful Palos Verdes. Today we're talking about ahi tuna. Fresh yellowfin to be specific. This is number one grade ahi from Hawaii. You can look at the translucency of the, of the filet. Generally, ahi is graded like we grade gemstones or diamonds. So we're looking for color, we're looking for clarity, we're looking for cut, right? So the color on this is definitely an A. Um, you see a little bit of a change in color down here. That is not something that's bad. Actually what that is is natural omega-3 fat that you'll find in the eye. This is super high in protein, 100% protein here. A um, Couple of different applications for this. Obviously we do sell it as uh, number one ahi steaks in the case. Great for grilling, great for searing. I like to just add a little bit of Cajun seasoning on it, a little bit of sesame seed, and sear it in some hot sesame oil. Just two minutes on each side on a pan, or you could do it on the grill. Take it off, slice it real thin, add it to your favorite salad. It makes a wonderful protein accompaniment for any salad, especially if you're going Asian flair. Um, steaks, ahi, it, it has natural oils and you don't want to overcook ahi at any given time. It takes wonderful to marinate, right? Some of my favorite marinades is just a simple Italian dressing. Take a simple Italian dressing, let it sit in that Italian dressing, the vinegar will actually start to cook the filet. Get it on the grill, but no more than seven minutes on a side. We like to make them about an inch thick. They're fantastic on the grill. They're also great baked. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut a couple of steaks here. All right, we're gonna put these in the case. And then the rest of it, I'm gonna break down into pokey. Now pokey originated in the Poly from Polynesia. The term pokey actually means cut fish pieces. If, whether or not you knew this, the Hawaiian alphabet only has 14 letters. So there's only 14 letters in the, in the, in the alphabet. And that's probably why you notice most of the words sound, sound very similar. There's a very limited amount of characters that they can use. This is why their dances were more with signals than they were with words. So we're just gonna cut a couple of steaks. The rest of this I'm gonna break down into some pokey cubes. And we're gonna put out some sriracha pokey. We do a mayo with masago pokey here. And we do Hawaiian style pokey here. So here at Great American International Seafood Market, you could come down, buy it by the half pound, buy it by the pound, or just take some tuna home and explore on your own. A little bit of ponzu sauce, a little bit of sesame seed, maybe some wakami. It makes a wonderful homemade pokey. This is good for about three or four days in your refrigerator as it's packed here at Great American Seafood. You wanna, you wanna watch out for color changes. You wanna watch out for any rainbowing. If, if, you, if you do see a color change, it doesn't mean your tuna is bad. What it means is it probably shouldn't be consumed raw. So that's something you're gonna to wanna to fully cook. So I'm just gonna break this down here. This is the chain. The chain tends to have more sinew. Sinew is something that'll cook out. It's the fibers you see on the bottom of the tuna, right? These will cook out their tendons, for lack of a better term. Um, we don't like tendons in our pokey. Um, we like our pokey to be very, very, very smooth pieces. So I'm just gonna knock this out. If I were to plank this out here and plank it out here, that would be called a saku. Saku is what you traditionally use, uh, what you'll find in your sushi bars. Um, this, this product here is great for shish kebabs, um, chunks for the barbecue, they cook up wonderful. There's actually more flavor in the sinew pieces than there is in the crown. But for the, for the pokey, we're just gonna take the crown. So for that, I wanna do about one inch cubes. I'm just gonna plank this here. We're gonna run our knife down.
good morning. Thank you. you Place our pokey cubes in the bowl, and we're ready to sauce. This is Frankie the Bowl with another episode of From the Case to the Plate from Great American International Seafood Market in Palos Verdes.